So it's that time, almost Black Friday, Christmas, time to spend money on the people that you love. If you happen to love some musicians or people who are obsessed with buying stuff for their studios and you don't really know what to give them, you don't wanna blow a ton of money or maybe you just wanna get some stuff for yourself, I have a list of five things that are under $20 that personally for me helped make my home studio way more efficient. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a link at the top of the description to these items if you wanna pick them up. There's also all the other gear I use in my studio on that. We'll go through the top five and I'll explain how they're helping my studio and maybe can help your studio too. Okay, so here in my studio I have four, eight guitar, bass, acoustic things sitting around. We're usually when we're reaching for something, it's super quick. I have pedals over there and there's a tuner pedal there, but not all the time is someone next to the pedals. So a perfect solution are these Snark rechargeable tuners. Now these are awesome. I've actually had a couple Snarks before, it looks like. So pop it on the guitar, no cables, no nonsense, already charged, ready to roll. Wow, amazing that that's in tune. I think these are a great stocking stuffer, easy gift, something that we could all use more of. I have three of them, one for my bass, one for the acoustic, and then one that can get moved around on the electric guitars. Next, we are gonna go with something much more interesting. This, my friends, will change your entire experience in your studio. This is $14.99. It is made by OnStage. It's called a quick clip. Maybe some of you have used these before. It is exactly what you think. It is a quick clip for your microphones. So one end goes onto the microphone stand. You can see here on this stand, I have the quick clip already installed. So you can take the mic on and off and it locks. If you look right at the top here, you can see this thing locks in so the $3,500 microphone does not fall off. You can trust these quick clips, but it just makes swapping microphones off and on stands way easier, way faster. It's the little tiny things that make the session go smoother. Quick clip just makes it go infinitely faster so you can swap between mics, especially if you're trying to do ABs or just move on with the session. These are maybe less, less sexy, but equally important for having an efficient studio. As I said, I have a handful of acoustic, bass, electric guitar, instruments like that. This is a strap from Ernie Ball. Honestly, it's the perfect strap for me. I've used more expensive straps before, fancier ones. Um, this is the easiest to adjust. It is $7.99 for this strap. Yeah, I've just picked up a few of these because I have some guitars that don't have straps. And it just makes it that much easier when you go to reach for a guitar and they already have a strap on it so you don't have to move it back. Oh, can you give me a strap from one of the other ones? Any of that, just having them already on the instruments makes the sessions run that much smoother. I think you can also get these in a variety of colors too. Okay, next, the Roland MIDI cable. 1999. this is a 20 foot MIDI cable. The way I'm using mine here is I have my Arturia Keystep uh, MIDI controller and I'm sending MIDI out, that's it, and I'm sending it into my Juno so I can get my sounds because I love using this thing on here, dial it in, and then once I have the sound I like, I can sit here at Logic and just play the, the sounds coming out of the Juno and that's going audio out to the mic pre's into the computer. So MIDI cables, not something that I think, I don't know, I'm not a big synth guy. So, but if you're looking for uh, something like this, 20 bucks, great gift, something that no one likes to buy. No one wants to buy MIDI cables. Last but certainly not least, a Diodario capo. I don't know what happened. I, I used to have a capo at some point in my life but I don't, and again, with a lot of guitars here and different players coming in and out or people just wanting to reach for something and you're doing writing sessions and stuff, really helps to have a capo nearby. One of those silly things that, again, no one really wants to buy, but they're not that expensive. The, uh, let me look, where's the price? Oh, uh, so this Diodario Artist Capo actually comes in at 
$21.99. I was wrong. I thought it was all under 20. Still super great. Got one right here on my Strat and I'd probably keep the other one right here with the acoustic. Let's see how easy it is to just slap on there. In tune. Sounds pretty good. <laughs> Capo, great stocking stuffer. There you have it, five things, all sort of under $20. All of them except for the Capo, $21. I think these are all very good Black Friday, Christmas gifts, whatever. Something to think about, like these were all things that I've been forgetting to get for my studio that have been a little bit of friction in the sessions that we've been doing. So just knocked them all out. They're all super cheap. And uh, once you get them, it just makes the day to day in the studio a lot easier. Click the links. Thanks for watching. Thank you Sweetwater for sponsoring this video and I'll see you guys in the next one.